How many times have you gone to a restaurant and seen dried food on the plate or spots on the silverware? It is an occurrence that's happening more often at local joints. But as Keisha Lopez explains, there may be a reason for that, one that health inspectors are catching on to. Wash off, rinse off, sterilize. It's a process of cleaning Roland Duty learned in the service that still applies at his restaurant today. In our industry, we need hot water, both an ease of cleaning and the sanitation and stuff that goes with it. Not only do restaurants need hot water, it's a requirement. But Health Department Supervisor David Lichty says recently inspectors are noticing more restaurants with no hot water in some parts of the building or not at all. Just last month, some people complained the Olive Garden in Waco went without hot water for several days. According to a health department report, the problem was eventually addressed, but Lipke explains why this is such a big violation. And washing is not being done as well as it should be. Dishwashing and dishwashing machines is not being performed properly. It also suggests cleaning is poor with no hot water for washing dishes. Having no hot water could be in response to a rising price of gas and electricity and skyrocketing maintenance costs. Still, no hot water, officials say, leads to a higher risk for contamination and the spread of germs, which can make matters worse. We're going to ask for immediate correction and possibly uh, temporary closure until they get it fixed. It's a problem Duty says his restaurant shouldn't have.